So I'm having a chat with Bears and Trees. How are you? Good. I'm having a good time. Definitely am Bears and Trees, yes. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Slam Dunk, how was how's today been? How was yesterday? It's good. Yesterday was a very long day. We had to get here really early. We had sound check at 8 a.m. Yeah. and then we didn't play until 20 past 8. So 12 hours. But really good. The weather was great. Loving life. Yeah, someone told me it was going to be raining both days and I didn't pack any sun cream and I'm paying for it as a ginger person. It is, I'm running to every shade I can find. But yeah, it's a good time. It's good job we were in here now then. Exactly. Yeah, um, yeah I'm just absolutely exhausted, but <laughs> it's great. Yeah, yeah good, good. And uh, I mean, you weren't originally supposed to be here. No. It's quite a late <laughs> call up for you guys. What was it like kind of getting the call to say, can you come and, can you come and do Slam Dunk? Yeah, honestly, like it's... This is our first, like, I think, like, big, like, this kind of festival, like, lots of stages in a field, like, and obviously, like, one which we've known about since we were, like, kids and knew, yeah. like, music existed. Um, so it's literally amazing to be here, and it's so fun. Good. Um, yeah, and then we got, like, bumped up to, like, headline of our half of the stage, like, was it, like, two days before? Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's a bit wild. Yeah. No, it sounds it. I never know what I'm doing at any time. <laughs> I just get told to be somewhere, and I'm there. That's what I do. <laughs> and uh, obviously, once you've finished here, you'll be kind of wanting to do some more stuff. What, what's what's kind of the plan for the summer and kind of into the later in the year? Yeah, we've got. Um, so we had a we had a single out a couple of days ago. Um, so there's more to come for releases wise. A bit more to release, and we've got a couple more festivals coming up this summer. Okay. Um, and really just trying to enjoy it and and just like be a band and just like and just mess around and just see what happens. I think. Yeah, and with that <laughs> single that you dropped just a few days ago, tell us tell us a bit about it. You're best to tell about this. Oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> it's called Precipitation. Um, it's about getting caught in the rain and when something very beautiful is happening and learning to uh, notice how beautiful life can be when you let it um, and trying to notice the little joys in life, uh, even though life can be hard sometimes. Yeah. yeah. Good. Good. And obviously now we're looking forward to releasing more music are we uh -huh. gearing up towards maybe an EP is, was, is that the plan or is it just singles uh -huh. at the moment <laughs> maybe we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see <laughs> and yes good <laughs> <laughs> um, obviously when Covid hit a couple of years ago kind of everything stopped did you take, make the most of the time and, and write loads of stuff or we um, we have lived on the internet for so long that actually lockdown we just like were at home and we just went do you know what we we were a bit of an internet band before that anyway and with tiktok we just went let's do it so we were doing like board game nights on twitch and, and movie nights and stuff and we just did what we were doing as kids yeah. just at home and so honestly like lockdown was we made the most of it as we could and just like you said just just making the most of where you are everyone was at home online so we were like well why don't we join them and that was basically what we did <laughs> yeah good and uh, obviously being fairly new to the music industry, what was it that brought you guys together? What is it that made you kind of write music and want to work together on music? Um, we've actually known each other for a long time. So me and Ian have known each other since we were five years old. We met in primary school. Um, and then we met Nick at secondary school. And then George, we met at college. Um, and so we're friends first. And just who liked music and liked Fall Out Boy and yeah. MCR and just wanted to make more music. Um, yeah, so I basically, I got brought in to help their old band uh, record. Was that an album? Uh, I think old, uh, a, a load of songs. It wasn't good. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what it was. It was bad. <laughs> yeah, it was bad. Um, and then I think like well, the, one of the members just like wasn't there. So then we ended up kind of writing a song together and then just sort of, yeah, we just never stopped really. Good. It was quite a long time ago. We've been going for like seven years as a band. It's just like back then we were playing, you know, dive bars in Croydon where we're from. We were playing Sainsbury's car parks where, you know, when Sainsbury did close, no one was going to kick us out. <laughs> Our mates' uh, front rooms and stuff. And uh, yeah, just being friends, playing fun shows. It's only really recently that a lot of people have started to notice yeah. um, and that's just nice it's nice to have people come on and join in with our kind of friendship at this stage where we're a bit more confident in what we're doing so looking towards the end of the year this year obviously touring is going to be on on the cards what what else do you have kind of planned are you hoping to release that EP then or yeah well we've got yeah as we're saying like uh, we've got a few more releases at the end of the year got more touring at the end of the year um, hopefully going outside the country again maybe to the US hopefully Lots of stuff in the works, um, but yeah. 
Yeah, there's lots of stuff. And uh, maybe more writing. We just love what we do. We just want to just keep making music, keep playing it for people, and just having a good time. That's all. That's the plan. <laughs> Have a good time. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, guys, it's been a pleasure having thank a chat you so with much. you. Just thank you very much. Really appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. <laughs>